Hi everyone, I wanted to share with you the new Stampers Best releases, or just some of the new ones. I just received them today. Thank you, Susan, for the Super Rush order. Um, actually, her shipping is great. It's I think I ordered it two days ago, and it's here today. Um, and I ordered, I'll tell you, these are from the new releases. It's a King's Crown, and it's a nice size. Let's see, three inches by two. And I got this unmounted because I have my own mounting and um, in a previous in a previous video, which I'll link right here, um, I show how I use my hot knife. And what I do is I first trim the rubber. And actually, let me just take it out so you don't see the glare. Um, I trim the rubber out first. So I use... Uh, good precision scissors and trim the rubber, then mount it to the uh, cling cushing mount, and then use the hot knife to trim that, which is much more precise, much easier, and makes a much cleaner cut. Here's a, an example of one trimmed out, mounted and trimmed out. Very clean. Almost as clean as professionally uh, cut by Susan, but what I have available. This is a Florida alligator. I'm totally into these animals and oh my god I love 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 this one. It's a seahorse. Um, I don't know if many of you know but I was born and raised in Odessa which is on the Black Sea in what is now Ukraine but was former Soviet Union. And as a child I remember finding seahorses right on the shore um, of the sea um, and leaving them on rocks while we were at the beach and then taking them home. So I have very fond, very good fond memories of seahorses. So, and this is so detailed. Look at how cool that is. And then this one made me laugh out loud. <laughs> it says, Fat Penguin. Just wanted to say something that would break the ice. I literally laughed out loud. My husband walked into the room and said, what are you laughing at? So I showed him the image on screen and I got this and I got this one mounted. I don't know why, but I think I got a couple of things mounted and this one was just so stinking cute. It's barbecue. How adorable is that little piggy? Um, I can't wait to color him up with, um, with pinks. Oh my god. He's just so plump. I wish I had him in time for our 4th of July barbecue that we put on, but I could use him for next year's invitations. And then this really cute one is cruising, and I don't know if you could see because Flip doesn't focus very well, but if you keep it um, uh, 12 inches away from the lens, you could still see most of the detail. It has the uber happy vacationers on the ship bow. So cute. And then I got a couple of sentiments. A friend is someone who knows the song in your heart and can sing it back to you when you've forgotten the words. It's very true. Oh, sorry, was I out of frame? I'm trying not to get the glare. And it's a nice size, so you can make this either the focal point or an inside, the, inside a card sentiment. And this one is, Love is all passion, the strongest, for it attacks simultaneously the, heart, the head, the heart, and the senses. And it's a quote from Voltaire. Nice size again. And this one is, For it was not into my ear you whispered, but into my heart. It was not my lips you kissed, it was my soul. Oh, but my soul. Again, another really nice sentiment. And then this one, I absolutely knew I wanted to color with Copics or colored pencils or leave it as is monochromatically, but it's a really beautifully detailed rose with leaves and there's some op you know open buds again not trimmed and then the these are new borders that are available and this set is narrow botanicals and there's five a panel of five let you see I'm gonna mount them actually I think I'm gonna trim them out first and then trim them apart and then mount them because you're saving on the cushion uh, foam as well and I don't know if you could tell but this one has a cherub in it. They're really, really cool. And I love the fact that there's different options. Like this one has a lot of negative space, which will ink up and stamp. And this one has the opposite, positive space. And then this one is called Carved Botanical Borders. It's a set of four. 
and they're really beautifully detailed. Hopefully you're not getting too much of a glare. Um, and this one is called Ornate Mantles, a set of three. And they can go this way, or this way. Actually, I think the birds, you have to go this way. But these two, you can stamp in either direction. And then because I wanted everybody to be able to, or I wanted someone to try out stamps that they haven't, I'm going to give this one away. I got an extra one. So if you leave a comment, actually, this is what I'll do. Why don't you stop by the Stamper's Best Facebook page. Um, Susan just created a Facebook page, and that's where, she'll, where she will be rolling out the newest releases, the photos of the new releases. So I'll include a link below, stop by there, and then come back here and leave a comment that you've been there and you'll be entered in for a chance to win this adorable seahorse. There you go, and I'll leave this open for a week. Um, so if you stop by, and I'll also include a link to the Stamper's Best site directly. Um, there's also Stamper's Best YouTube channel where um, designers post um, our, their projects are posted there, so I encourage you to stop by there as well. If you have any questions for me, please leave me a comment. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching.